Thanks to the damage to the timeline, the doctor summoned his ten previous selves and their respective TARDISes to save their companions. Under the orders of the master, Adam released an army of Ottens at them. Frobisher, meanwhile, released all of the doctor's companions, all of which began attacking the Ottens. The master then revealed the Otten attack as a distraction, as he blasted the rest of the chronal energy he had drained into the doctor's TARDISes. This would cause all of them to overload, which would destroy all of them and the doctors at the same time and thus destroying the universe as well. Adam, deciding that he did not want the universe destroyed and realizing he had been used by the master, fought back against him. He attacked the master, who hit him back with a sharp object, injuring him. Then, Adam blasted the computer in an explosion that engulfed him. During his last moments, he apologized to the doctor, and told Rose he understood why the doctor's companions were so willing to risk themselves for him. The doctors and his companions buried him outside his time palace, with the inscriptions, Adam Mitchell, a companion true.